WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Tuesday, the 26th of December, wrapping up the week, wrapping up the month, wrapping up the year. Wow, this is going to be quite a year. So we're looking at the Dow right now, up 50 at 37,436. Just kind of stuck in this rectangle formation from the 37,641 high uh, four sessions ago. And now we're looking at the S&P, also kind of stuck in the middle of the range. Uh, trade. Actually, it's in the upper part of the range. Up 11 at 47.66, 47.78.01 was the um, most recent high. 48.18 was the January 2022 high. It's two years ago, almost two years ago. Looking at the uh, QQQ and the X100, uh, trading just under the, the all-time high of 410.97, established last week, is trading for 10.24, what is this, 70 cents, something like that, away from an all-time high. Very nice action, up $1.52 at 409.90. IWM, the Russell 2000, uh, up $1.03 at 202.51. Uh, very nice. It hasn't taken out the high of uh, Monday or Friday, sorry, uh, but it's still acting very well. Weekly charts very strong. Uh, we're looking at gold. Gold was up a little bit. Now it's down a little bit, down one at 2068, just kind of sideways. Um, actually holding very well, not breaking down, not breaking out, just kind of content in this middle range at 2068. Looking at the dollar, the dollar keeps making lower lows. Uh, today didn't make a low low from Friday, but in fact it's down 13 ticks of 101.59, getting close to some kind of uh, support attempt. We're looking at crude oil. Crude oil is up quite sharply. It's up almost two at 75.54. Quick leg peak A, peak B, peak C, and now leg D. Uh, we'll see how long this can last. So far, it's very nice. Looking at bonds, and this is going to be key because the bonds right now. Or up about uh, 930 seconds, almost a half a point at 124. And what we're really looking at is a kind of a sideways uh, motion between maybe for about a week and a half. We'll see if it's going to break to the upside or downside because that's where yields are going to go. And we're watching that closely. I'll be back in a few moments for the Tiger Nutrition's Hour. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. I'll see you in a few minutes. I've got a lot to discuss. See you soon.